Barkley, you wanna go for a ride? Bye. Good old hit training, baby. So, uh, so today I'm doing my typical uh, routine. I'm gonna knock out 10 to 12 hundreds, depending on how I'm feeling. Uh, it's kind of cold, the wind is blowing. You, I don't know how well you can hear me, the wind's kind of blowing uh, pretty hard, but uh, yeah, kind of cold for my liking. All right, definitely wasn't feeling 12 today. I knocked out 10, I'm dead. <clears throat> I'm about to go pay some bills and uh, get back to the crib. Someone asked me a question about how long I fast. I do uh, 16 hours fasted. I eat all of my calories within an eight hour window. So typically I try to go from uh, 12.30 to 8.30 and then uh, fast until 12.30 the next day. We could be chilling somewhere on the rooftop. We could be over the web, but we'll never ever really get that far. Cause you always be slipping, slipping before you reach the top. And I won't go and waste your time. That ship sailed way too long ago. You don't know. It's fine. Right now time is going too slow and I, I, I won't look back, stay on track. Every time that we try to put in our feet, it, goes better, huh? it just feels like the water is getting too deep. We gave it our best, I tried to be It's been slipping, slipping for you reach the top. Don't we waste your time. Everybody in Lambos, and we're gonna ride down in that Germany street where you go as fast as you can. Alright guys, what is up? I am back with another quick tutorial. Been a while since I put a uh, tutorial in a video or vlog, but wanted to uh, show you guys something cool. Something that um, uh, we came across the other day in a session. Uh, it's the session with Tolan that you guys just saw. It's actually the record that you guys were just hearing. Um, I wanted to show this just to like kind of show how you could be in tune with an artist. You'll find a lot of times artists can't really express uh, the sound that they're looking for, but just knowing your tools, knowing, um, understanding what type of vibe the record is, um, you know, taking the, uh, the, the words that they're trying to use to describe what they're looking for and just, you know, realizing what tools you have, being willing to, you know, play around with stuff and, you know, you and the artist together can uh, combine your thoughts and vision to create a sound that hopefully is in the ballpark or exactly what they're looking for. So when um, creating this vocal, Tolan really didn't know uh, how to describe it. He just kept uh, saying the word old. He wanted it to sound like an old, um, he kept saying 60s, 70s. Um, but he was just kind of throwing a lot of words out there and, um, we sat here and just played around with a few plugins and this is the vibe that we came up with. I'm going to go ahead and play it. I 
so that's where we ended up um and just going off of a few things i'll i'll kind of tell you what i was thinking and how um you know why i went this direction one i know tolan um you know he's a very different type artist he kind of reminds me of andre 3000 a little bit um and I was whenever he was describing, uh, you know, how he wanted it to sound. I was kind of thinking of like, um, you know, like the song "Prototype" from Andre 3000. How it's real airy. Um, it's kind of got an older sounding vibe to it. And um, you know, when when he says the word "old," automatically I'm thinking "Roll Off Top End." Um, so to to create that sound. Um, what I did was two, two things. So I'll play it without these two plugins to let you hear the difference. I can make it come to life. I have powers. So, so obviously that sounds a little bit more modern, you know, bringing back that high end. So what I did was two things. One, I added the Metaflanger. And I just put it on the chorus light preset, and then I messed with the mix knob until it felt right. So I'll uh, put this, I'll toggle this in and out so you can hear the difference. I can make it come to life. I have powers. I can make you feel alive. So it just gives it more of that eerie vibe, more just a chorus effect, really, you know, um, just giving it its, its own vibe. Uh, so I liked what that was doing. I did that first. And then instead of using a low pass filter with the EQ, I really like using the lo-fi plugin. I, I picked up this trick from uh, an interview that uh, 40 who mixes and produces for Drake it's a you guys have probably seen it when he was on Pensado's place but he talked about um, you know not using low pass filters to roll off the the high end but he likes to use the low fi plugin that comes free with Pro Tools so um, what I did was I just grabbed this plugin I uh, lowered the sample rate and then I just added a little bit of distortion, a little bit of saturation. And this just gives it, you know, more of an old school vibe. You know, you get a lot of uh, satur a more saturated sound and a um, not as bright sound, you know, back in the old days, the older days whenever they were recording to tape. So um, I'll toggle this in and out so you can hear it. I can make it come to life. I have powers I can make you feel alive I have powers Yeah, so um, that's what we went with And then uh, as far as processing uh, Let's see here on the lead track little bit of corrective EQ with the fab filter, hitting it with the 1176 to the SSL channel. I'm doing some EQ and compression with this. Then uh, some slate plugins, just uh, giving it a little bit of more, a little bit more saturation on the high end and low end. Um, and then this bomber is a, I don't even know what this plugin really is. Um, I just like what it does. <laughs> I set it to the present sound, uh, put the intensity up around 40, 43 or so. Then I actually dialed it back. Um, yeah, if you guys have the slate plugins, you just have to play with that. And then uh, the S1 just to spread the vocal out a little bit. 
uh, Drowned in Reverb, my role in Dimension D. If you guys have been following the channel, you know I uh, love using that plugin. And then a eighth note delay. I can make it come to life. I have powers. Camera on. Show is. All right, what's up, guys? I know I haven't. Uh, been talking to you guys very much, but it's nothing personal. Still love you guys. Still rock with you. Still rock with you. But um, yeah, it's Saturday evening. Um, got up this morning, worked out with Kiani, which I took the camera and forgot to get footage somehow. I don't, I don't know. Can't explain that. But really good workout. Are we going to the store or not? We can just go somewhere in Lawrence. Just head to Lawrence. So got a good workout in, came back, uh, chilled with Sierra a little bit, and I had to chill with her because she sent me this message right here. So you know how, how that goes. So did all that. Then I had a session with Tolan from noon to four, which you guys saw. And now it is 6 p.m. We are headed to Lawrence, Kansas to uh, celebrate Sierra's little sister's birthday, which was what, like two weeks ago? Yeah. Yeah, it was a while ago, but um, yeah, just had a few busy weekends. So we're just now getting together to celebrate. And I'm kind of nervous because we're going, first we're going to eat, which I'm not nervous about that. But after that, we're going to uh, this place called the breakout room or breakout KC or something like that which just to let you guys know a little bit about me I'm not really afraid of too many things but I am kind of claustrophobic and so being in small rooms especially being locked in a small room kind of scares the crap out of me so you're not locked in it I thought that was the point you're locked in a room. you can get out if you need to though it's not like you're trapped in there forever if you need to go to the bathroom you can go to the bathroom Whatever. I feel like I'm gonna be locked in a room, so I'm kind of nervous about that. And I guess you gotta find like clues and whatnot to be able to get out of the room. And there's like an hour time limit or something crazy. So, um, but yeah, I'm gonna suck it up. I'm doing this for for Skyler, it's a little Skyler Washington. So yeah, headed to Lawrence right now. I'm excited because I've saved up all of my carbs, all of my fats, and we're, I'm about to grub. I'm about to grub, about to have a repeat meal. Um, and I know you guys can't hear me because all this paper going, but yeah, catch you guys next clip. I can make you feel alive. 